Hey yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Um, I just did a few big things. I've been working on something over the past few days. And I'm gonna show you guys. Be excited! We are back. It's your boy Lit Larry. That's right. I changed my motherfucking name. So what I'm doing right now is I'm going around trying to uh, clean up these buildings that are around my base because I don't want just stuff spawning all the time, especially with the parasites. So the more places that things can spawn that I have sealed off, or at least I don't allow more spawning in, then the better for the long run. So I just place a bunch of torches everywhere. Try to clear the buildings. Um, I made a very drastic uh, change to the base, which I will be showing you guys uh, once I'm done clearing this particular building. Because that is why I'm out here in the first place. But yeah, welcome back to the channel, everybody. It's been a minute. It's been a few days. You know, I've been living life, trying to pay my bills. But I've also just been, I don't want to just show you guys some bullshit, so kind of want there to, wow, useless ass chest. Kind of want there to be something done every episode, you know? Um, so I'm going to keep doing it like this. I just want this building to be secure. Ooh, there's a chest in there too. I just don't want stuff spawning in my immediate vicinity. Like they already are going to be. So the more I can mitigate that, the better. What's in here? Nothing. Cool. Uh, what is new that I can show you? Ooh, yeah. I got this M16, guys. I found some fiberglass, and I built me an M16. Now, if you guys watched the last season, that's the gun I was using last season, too. I like this M16, and it was easy to craft, so we are going to run with it, at least for the time being. I want to make a sniper. That's what I really want to make, a sniper rifle. That would be awesome. So we'll be making that soon, too. Ooh, another chest. What's in here? Nothing at all. Maybe I've been here already. I have been playing in this area for a little bit now. Even though we're only on, like, what, episode 4? Last season, it was more of a... um straight up like a let's play like everything i did at least for a long while i showed it all i recorded everything but it was kind of boring and i can't be asked with editing or anything right now i'm you know i'm gonna be learning that soon maybe for this series maybe for the next one i don't know but as of now can't be bothered with that shit because i don't got time i got too many big plans for this season to waste my time editing when I could just be doing stuff. Getting shit done. Gotta get rid of that buglin. So, one thing I did already is I allowed the parasites to evolve. So, that's right. The global parasite level is increasing now. So, no more handicap for us. Oh, what, pig? Whoa, where'd this guy come from? I haven't seen any wildlife. He's definitely infected. I'm probably infected already right now. Yeah, so that means that pig got it too. Uh, so I might as well just kill it. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Get rid of all this. Um, okay, I also just really don't want to die because I'm level 16 right now. I uh, also have acquired these crystals of skills, which if I remember correctly, uh, means that if I do it... Oh, maybe he wasn't infected. He dropped raw pork chop and he didn't turn into a thing. Wow, I should have should have tried to save him. Whatever. There will be more eventually, even though they will be infected. I'll figure it out. Uh, so you do that, I should have gotten some skills. I should have checked my skills beforehand. But some skill points, I think it is. Which is neat. So, I think we are ready to head back now, even though there is this big ass. Oh, it's not a cave, okay. Yeah, we're, we're ready to head back now. I'm um, down to one torch. Can't really illuminate anything anymore. Alright, time to do some parkour. <laughs> It doesn't work. Thought that would work. Thought I remember doing. 
doing it earlier. Okay. So we're gonna head back to the base and check this out, guys. Your eyes do not deceive you. We do indeed have a perimeter. So it is a double wide moat of lava. It's not very deep. It's only about like three blocks deep. Uh, only the top are source blocks. Oh, another pig! But he's dying from the. What is he dying from? Do I have any carrots? No, I should have some downstairs though. What happened to this? Looks like some of my gates got destroyed. But yeah, double wide pit of lava all the way around. Barbed wire fence, barbed wire on top. Nothing's gonna get through that. For now. Um, and something might get through that uh, hole we just created. So let me go ahead and build another couple of fences. We haven't done anything to this. I've just been letting it run this whole time. We've doubled everything. So I got one. Where are my sticks? Wood. Good old Minecraft stuff. There's always Minecraft stuff. Oops. Wrong way around. There we go. We got three of them. That's all we need. Let's go plug in that, uh, that hole in the wall. We don't need holes in our walls. Also, I should get some carrots for that pig. Try to get it over here. That's crazy. That's two pigs I've seen right next to each other. I haven't seen a pig in a long time. I don't think I ever have seen a pig this playthrough, actually. So that's interesting. Um, last season, we discovered that there's definitely... Uh, I'm going to keep two. There's definitely... All the animals, I think. Sheep, pig, chicken, cows. Find them all in the jungle inside the biosphere, I think. I forget how I did the animals last season. But also last season, all my animals kept getting infected with cough. No matter what I did. Some of them even died and turned into, turned into infected stuff. So, I don't have cough. And neither does he, because he would have given it to me. Great. All right. Come on, buddy. Come on. All the way through. There we go. All right. Now you're stuck in this. You can die by going on the barbed wire. So I'm going to get rid of these. Actually, no. I'm going to dig him a little pit. Oh, that's the lower levels. I already started to... Try to plug these up a little bit. All right, that's fine. All right, come on, buddy. Good boy, you're so obedient. What a good little pig. Hey, come here. I just told you you were obedient, and you're like, nope. Hey, bro. I got, bro. I got a carrot for that ass. Alright, he's gonna stay right here. Oops. Sorry, buddy. Didn't mean to hit you. You okay? Still got a heart and a half. Let's give him a carrot. Yay, you're in love with yourself. Weirdo. Okay. Um, so, as you guys can see, the perimeter goes all the way around the base. The whole way. There's three entrances. One right here, one right there, and another one on the other side over there. I also uh, checked this whole thing out, made sure it was chill all the way around. Here's entrance number two. And over here, you guys can see how this side is. It's almost like a dam. It's really cool. So there's nothing getting over on this side, that's for sure. I mean, I'm pretty sure nothing's really getting over on any side with this kind of setup. The problem is, um, also that's not true. Some of the parasites can leap and some of them are just going to be so strong that they'll just survive going through it and their adaptation means that they'll go in the lava and they'll become adapted to the lava and they'll no longer take damage however there is a minimum i believe i forget if i changed his value or if it just is the case there is a minimum of uh one damage taken 
by the parasites, regardless of their, uh, you know, regardless of their, uh, how much they've evolved to negate that damage, they will always take one point of damage per hit minimum. It doesn't go below that. So everything is technically killable with just one weapon. It'll just deal one damage at a time. But what that means is stuff that shoots fast, like the M16 is not, uh, full auto but like full auto guns or like um machine gun turrets and stuff they will be able to kill all the big guys over a long time if they're only dealing one damage per shot but they still will be able to some of them guys got like 50 uh health like 100 health 200 health so in theory we should be relatively not extremely completely getting decimated every fucking second with this kind of setup but i'm still not 100 percent sure if that's the case or not now as i said i did allow the parasites to evolve now so let's see if we go to sleep if it'll go to stage one or stage two i don't even know what stage we're at let's see hang on srp get stage no it's srp evolution get Invalid command. Cool. So P evolution. Okay. okay, let's just do SRP and then tab SRP parasites. Yeah, that's what it was. Get phase. No. S RP. Oh, evolution. SRP evolution. zero total points 43 so the they've gotten 43 points in the past like hour i've been playing um and they needed what did it say and they need 50 points they're almost at stage one okay and they can't lose points apparently so i might have to change that so there you go guys that's what we've been up to and that's what i'm thinking now i also now that i have this compound set up i kind of with what why do i only have one here too i was convinced i put three around all of them guess not now that i have this compound set up i also would like to um get the tectopia stuff started well look at that he died see he was infected with cough that's what happens when you die and you're infected with cough. You give you give birth to a to an alien parasite thing, um, incomplete form, or I think sometimes it's it's like your head or whatever. But you guys can see all this. It's pretty tight. All right, it finishes. I mean, it was a huge project, guys. This took me so long. One piece of lava on every top block of this here. There's like over 300 pieces of lava. It was crazy. But we got it done. And here we are, safe and sound on our base. We can just run around. Okay, what is going on? Is something getting in here? Are those fence gates just not strong enough? If these are gone, I'm going to lose it. It's on fire. Oh, they burn. They burn up because they're right next to the lava. Okay. Oops. Okay, guys. So y'all are just gonna burn up on me. I gotta put uh, iron doors, I guess, with buttons on either side. I hate iron doors. It's already such a pain getting in here. Look at this shit, guys. Every time I come in here, I gotta. Ooh, I'll make sure I push the right. Ooh, and get in fast enough, and then. Ooh, and if I mess up, it's like, oh no. Nah, it's closed. But everybody knows that. That's a common Minecraft thing. So, those explosions we hear, those are parasites evolving, I'm pretty sure. Every time you hear one of those explosions, there's a parasite evolving into a different form. Which is no good, no bueno. You can't shoot those things. I already tried with the one that was over there earlier. Tries again. Yep, you can't shoot those things. So I have to go out there. That area looks pretty cool. Um, yeah. Just wondering if there's any more pigs out there. That'd be pretty tight. What happened to my pig? Is he dead already? I don't see him. Might be 
be too close to the wall. I don't know. Maybe he got cough. Do I have cough? Yep. Cough is call of the hive. Anyway, so I'm thinking for next episode, what I want to do is I want to start. Um, I definitely want to start either with Techtopia or I might try to set up a digital miner setup first. But I think Techtopia would be more fun because the digital miner is going to be a lot more work and it's going to be a big difference. So it'll be a while for our next episode. While if we do Techtopia, I could even maybe make an episode of me starting it. I might even do that tonight. She, who knows? Yeah, guys, that's where we started over there. Um, yeah. So thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to cut it off here. Just want to show you guys this sweet sweet oh and i made this uh secondary platform right underneath the main one because you couldn't really walk around up there i didn't feel like getting rid of the barbed wire i just made this other one here um so nothing should be able to get up here either except for maybe through there i gotta check that tree let's see is there barbed wire yeah let me still get rid of some of this all right so uh yeah that's gonna be it guys Stay tuned for another episode, and thank you for watching, guys. Have a good one.